uh, Aman was काफी pressurizing. I'm not going to talk, go and talk to Aman. So over innovation can sometimes even like be a counterproductive thing for business. Yes, it has to be something very relatable. I heard uh, from a different founder that they were selected by default. But I don't think that that would be possible. I was ready to go for 80 lakh or 5 percent. I have a counter offer: 90 lakhs for 3 percent. That mechanics brand, yeah, वो आपके dad की company का है. Yes, yes. The first question that I have for you, basically, is that let's imagine a scenario that you have to sort of take a challenge up. That challenge, me, you have to do is start a new toy brand from scratch, mm-hmm. right? So, what would be your process? And you have limited capital. Imagine, कर लो जो भी एक समझ लो एक middle class India में इंसान है उसने थोड़ी बहुत savings की होगी. So, what will be your roadmap? What will be your step towards launching a toy brand from the beginning? and what will be like your first year plan so that somebody can get inspired from the steps that you tell us so first thing would be that uh, i would think about the product you know ke kaun sa product apne ko launch karna hai because how you figure out on that will kind of create the entire business also around it mm-hmm. so now to finalize on the product we will have to understand what is the average cost of so i know that um, if this is the first toy that i want to make right and it's a whole toy brand that's going to be dependent i know ki पाँच सौ रुपये का जो बजट है दैट इज द अल्टीमेट बजट दैट इज अ स्वीट स्पॉट फॉर अ टॉय यू नो लॉट्स ऑफ पीपल यूज इट फॉर गिफ्टिंग इट्स अ सिंगल नोट इट्स कंफर्टेबल सो दैट वुड बी अ प्राइस पॉइंट दैट आई वुड सेट एट आई वुड लुक एट द टॉय दैट वॉट काइंड ऑफ अ टॉय बिकॉज नाउ राइट नाउ आई एम थिंकिंग अबाउट जस्ट बिल्डिंग अ टॉय ब्रांड राइट सो आई एम नॉट थिंकिंग अबाउट स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम अ विजन और समथिंग लाइक दैट बट आई वुड थिंक दैट वॉट इज द काइंड ऑफ कैटेगरीज दैट पेरेंट्स आर वेरी इजी टू बाई अभी एजुकेशनल तो होना ही चाहिए इंडिया के अंदर टूडे टॉय हैज टू बी एजुकेशनल शुड इट बी एन आर्ट एंड क्राफ्ट टॉय शुड इट बी अ रोल प्ले टॉय शुड इट बी समथिंग यूनिक आई वुड ट्राई टू थिंक ऑफ समथिंग दैट वुड बी वेरी यूनिक एंड हैव मास अपील you know because it has to be a really easy sell so those are the first two things that i would look after uh, making sure who my target audience what is the maximum you know crowd of people who are actually buying what is the price mm-hmm. what is unique what is the category so once that the toy is kind of fi- finalized um, then i would think about how to do the communication of that toy to the customer so you know in our also history what i have learned is bahut bar hum log ne dekha hai ki toy ka idea bahut badhiya rehta hai yeah but it is a complex idea hmm iska challenge kya hota hai ki it is so difficult to communicate that to the audience right. that um, it might fail just because of that so over innovation can sometimes even like be a counterproductive thing for business right you don't want to make it too complex yes it has to be something very relatable so the audience you have to understand the audience may not know everything how much i know about a toy right. so from that one few seconds of an instagram post if i have to capture their attention it has to be on something that's very simple to understand hmm so can we say that if you're thinking about a product and you should think about marketing it and can you communicate ki bhai ye product kya karta hai aise 5 se 10 second ke andar right maybe that will help you in terms of getting some traction in the business in initial stages right absolutely because however good your product is if you can i would i would feel that if you're not figuring out a good way to communicate how good your product is change the product mm. because your communication is just that important mm. everything depends upon that right right so that's a great way to sort of like figure out ki kya bechna chahiye ek thoda sa framework mein pata chala hai but can we go a little bit deeper on that like let's say you have to take that decision right are there any is there a process that you would go through are there some tools some sort of system that of research that you will go through to figure out ki bhai what would be your product because right now your slate is empty uh, that's a very good question uh, there are, are lots of tools available there are tools on amazon that tell you what are the like if you go on amazon and you see the best selling toys right you know amazon ka ranking rehta hai it shall rank 1400 or rank 2 out of so many mm-hmm. so that is a great way to identify which products work mm-hmm. so uh, i believe quick commerce websites like blinkit and zepto also today check these things before they decide what product to put on our portal or not mm-hmm. because they also know ki jo amazon pe fatafat bik raha hai वो इन पे बिकेगा सो दे ऑल्सो यूज इट सो फॉर पीपल आर स्टार्टिंग अ बिजनेस इट्स अ ग्रेट वे टू आइडेंटिफाई वॉट प्रोडक्ट वुड रियली वर्क राइट राइट सो लुकिंग लुकिंग अप ऑन द वेबसाइट फिगरिंग आउट वॉट इज मूविंग मोर राइट एंड दैट कुड बी योर सोर्स ऑफ इंस्पिरेशन राइट और राइट सो लेट्स टेक वन स्टेप अहेड राइट कि प्रोडक्ट आपको मिल गया आपने सोच लिया कि क्या प्रोडक्ट बनाना है हमें राइट अब ये क्लियर हो गया दिस इज ऑल ऑफ दिस हासिल हैपन प्रिटी मच फ्रॉम अ रूम फ्रॉम योर लैपटॉप राइट 
what do you do after that how do you now bring this idea to life what would be your steps from there on i've never done this but i know that this would be the route if i had to do a new product like this mm-hmm. सो uh, so, पहले तो थोड़ा पैसा इन्वेस्टमेंट करना ही पड़ेगा राइट right. so, so, पे जाएगा क्राउड सोर्सिंग प्लेटफॉर्म राइट यू हैव एन इंटरेस्ट टॉय इज अ कंज्यूमर प्रोडक्ट पीपल आर गोइंग टू गेट एक्साइटेड थिंक ऑफ अर क्राउड सोर्सिंग प्लेटफॉर्म और थिंक अबाउट समथिंग वेर यू कैन क्रिएट लॉट्स ऑफ एक्साइटमेंट थ्रू social media mm-hmm. you know you market an idea you market 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 it aggressively mm-hmm. uh, get leads as to people who are very passionate about it right. get a few thousand people like that ready then on one day you build your community and then on one day no you go and you do a launch you do it on a crowd sourcing platform right you know you see what kind of a response you get mm-hmm. then you can start putting it on amazon and then you can start communicating this to your tar- target audience right. so the first thing that i would do is i think even before uh, Uh, launching a product would be try to create a small basic community around it you know community probably of influencers or whoever it is who would be interested in a product as unique as that right. so once you have that core community that kind of is there to support you then it starts becoming easier because when you go to amazon you can you can you know you can tell people support us by buying us on amazon mm-hmm. uh you can go to hamleys and say that see i've got a community of so many people let me do this activation i'll get them all to come to hamleys right. so when you have a small little army also with you na you can actually start doing a lot of things great, great, so great. Uh, this is a very unusual way of doing it but i think that this makes the most sense in today's world where mm-hmm. people are bombarded with new new products all the time absolutely 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 in between there is a step right so we discovered the product and we have found a decent i would say sustainable low uh, low effort strategy wherein you are trying to build an audience before you launch the product to the market so that once you drop the product right there is a level of interest and people come and buy and try it out and you get immediate feedback very quickly right but in the in between these two steps there is basically the whole part of making it real right manufacturing in in technical terms okay. right so what would you do in that domain can i use the experience that i have right now no then i would go to somebody who has this guy who has my experience that i have right now right. because i think uh, uh, there is this you know shark tank maybe wo log poochte hai ki aapka moat kya hai how are you going to defend it Haan. right and manufacturing is no longer a moat for a lot of people i don't agree with that completely because mm-hmm. today i can go to china and i can make this product okay. Right. what i sell for 1600 rupees you will be able to sell it for 3000 rupees right there are so many people who are trying to compete with me in the space that we are and instead of having the background of manufacturing mm-hmm. they go to china and they get it made they spend a lot of money mm-hmm. only to realize that the duties and the tooling right. and the transport and the labor over there is expensive and all of that after doing all of that you end up with a product that's almost twice the price of what you could have done it if you had the uh knowledge of uh, manufacturing before hmm. so i would go to somebody in india who has that sort of knowledge not one person i would go to 10 people hmm. because main aapko ek baat batata hu india ke andar experience na thoda broken rehta hai so how do how does a person become a manufacturer or a uh, expertise either my father has done it so i do it mera koi knowledge or education nahi hai uske andar aur I'll give you an example of a tool room, right? जिधर mold बनाते हैं। तो एक बंदा झाड़ू करता रहेगा, वो owner बोलेगा ये machine handle करो। hmm. तो वो जाके वो machine का देखेगा, ऐसा कुछ गड़बड़ हुआ ना तो मेरे को बता देगा। That yeah. much. So he'll start doing that. He's like now do this also. चल इसको है ना ये थोड़ा setting कर। In one month he becomes a operator. Oh. You know? Then he's an operator of one machine. He becomes an operator of another machine. Eventually he'll become a supervisor. You know? And then he'll become a tool room manager. that doesn't mean he really knows how to do that job mm. so go to the people who are doing really good work find out how they are doing it because it design ke andar bhi hai na design consideration for manufacturing is a very high uh, uh, priority when you are doing any design mm. so once you get that experience i think it will become much easier for you to do it this brings me to the next question which is basically uh, that you've done engineering right as i heard in the episode mm. right so how much does engineering as a thought process or as a like degree ki to main itni value nahi karunga because degree kuch sabke paas ho jati hai mm-hmm. but jo experience hota hai engineering ka how much does that help you in a physical product business like this one so the thing that engineering helped me with the most was uh, being able to work hard mm-hmm. right engineering pass karte karte itne bade books padhte padhte 
clearly you're not foundations are not strong in spite of that somehow you have to pass an exam excel at it whatever it is uh it is very tough so people work very hard so the one thing i know is that when i hire engineers i know if whether they have the cognitive ability or not hard work to rahega hi you know so that was the most important thing um that i feel engineering has taught me apart from that थियोरेटिकली मतलब मैंने बोला भी था आई थिंक शार्क टैंक के अंदर दैट आई शुड टेक पार्ट इन ऑफ रोबोटिक्स कॉम्पिटिशन सो वेन आई वुड गो फॉर दोज कॉम्पिटिशन आई वुड बी बिल्डिंग अ कार इन द फर्स्ट टाइम आई बिल्ड अ कार इज स्टार्ट गोइंग राउंड एंड राउंड यू नो आई ट्राई टू डू समथिंग इन इट फेल बोले अरे यार ये कैसा फेल हो गया इट सो ऑब्वियस सच सिंपल थिंग तो उसको ठीक करते 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 ऐसा इंजीनियरिंग सीख लेते ना दैट इट इज दैट इज वेर माई रियल एजुकेशन वॉज सो वट एवर आई इफ वो सीखने के बाद अगर मैं क्लास में बैठ के वो वाला टॉपिक अगर आया ना मेरे को बहुत इजी हो जाता था समझने को एंड वंस आई अंडरस्टूड इट इट बिकम्स वेरी इजी टू मतलब सब प्रैक्टिकली वंस यू डू समथिंग एक बार आपने कुछ प्रैक्टिकली ट्राई किया तो माइंड की रिटेंशन बेटर हो जाती है बहुत स्ट्रांग हो जाती है आई थिंक इट्स बिकॉज लाइक आई वुड प्रॉब्ली फ्रॉम माई नॉलेज फ्रॉम माई एक्सपीरियंस वो न्यूरल नेटवर्क बन जाता है थोड़ा सा पाथवेज बन जाता है सो यू नो इंटिवली की क्या हो सकता है राइट यू हैव सम सम यू नो इंट्यूशन बिल्ट for it after you've done it practically yes i think intuition no comes from a little bit of experience right abhi i'll just give you one example now when we talk about the specification of horsepower right gaadi mein itna horsepower itna horsepower horsepower hona chahiye when you're putting that much when you're working on a car for example okay tumne tweak kiya engine ko zyada power aa gaya now you drive it you feel what it feels like then you go you tweak it again fir you try you try some other car you're working in more powerful cars weaker cars abhi main aapko bolu na 200 bhp ka gaadi hai You know what that means by 200 bhp. जो बंदा क्लास में पढ़ा रहेगा 200 सौ बी एच पी का उसके लिए सिर्फ एक नंबर है वो उसके लिए वो एक नंबर है अभी वो नंबर सही है गलत है इंट्यूशन uh, तुम आएगा ही नहीं बिकॉज एक्सपीरियंस ही नहीं है तुम्हारे पास सो आई थिंक इंट्यूशन इज अज अ फैक्टर इज अ रिजल्ट ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस इन दैट स्पेस विच मेक्स यू फील समथिंग डज नॉट सीम राइट ओवर यूर because you had enough experience of what right should look like and what wrong should look like mm. so that is where i think intuition comes from. interesting i mean engineering matlab how was your four years like it was a four year engineering process like which which field were you in i was in mechanical engineering mechanical oh that is that is very aligned with what you're doing right now to yeah. some extent right i had actually recently come across a consultation call thi meri to usme bhi ek engineer ke sath tha main call pe and usne bhi apna toy brand start kiya hai yes. this is like 6 months ago i had this call तो दैट वॉज वेरी इंसाइटफुल फॉर मी यार इंजीनियरिंग पढ़ने के बाद उसने अपना मैनुफेक्चरिंग यूनिट लगा के एक किड्स बिल्डिंग ब्लॉक टॉय बिजनेस स्टार्ट किया अमेजोन पे एंड ही वेन आई चेक विद इम लास्ट सिक्स मंथ कोई वॉज लाइक आई वुड नेट फाइव सी आर दिस फाइनेंशियल ईयर सो दैट वॉज वेरी इंस्पायरिंग टू नो कि इस तरीके से भी अब इंडिया सोच सकता है इट्स नॉट जस्ट कि जॉब कर लो और वो कर लो थोड़ा सा अपने क्या और भी कर सकते हो थोड़ा और डीप जा सकते हो बिजनेस स्टार्ट कर सकते हो तो आप इंजीनियर को देखोगे ना दे आर दैट ओनली दे आर प्रॉब्लम सॉल्वर दैट्स व्हाई ऑल द टॉप टेक कंपनी ऑल द टॉप टुडे स्टार्टअप्स एंड ऑल देखो तो कोई ना कोई इंजीनियर ही शायद है आई मीन आई एम नॉट सेइंग दैट ओनली इंजीनियर या या एब्सोल्युटली एज एन इंजीनियर यू यू बिकम अ प्रॉब्लम सॉल्वर सो हिज कोर इंजीनियरिंग माइट नॉट हैव हेल्प्ड हिम इन स्टार्टिंग दैट बिजनेस इन द फैक्ट्री बट द एक्सपीरियंस ऑफ प्रॉब्लम सॉल्विंग हैज हेल्प्ड हिम डू दैट टेक्निकल थिंग इज एन एडेड बोनस यू नो तो मेरे को तो लगता है कि कोई भी नॉलेज इतना इंपॉर्टेंट नहीं है जितना वो uh, uh, जितना वो स्किल है टू बी टू यूज दैट नॉलेज क्योंकि नॉलेज तो आज गूगल पे आपको कौन सा भी क्वेश्चन फॉर्मूला पूछो तो मिल जाएगा कौन सा फॉर्मूला यूज करना है दैट इज वॉट यूर वही ह्यूमन जो अभी भी ह्यूमन की नीड है अदरवाइज ए आई इज वेरी मच टेकिंग ओवर so that is the difference in my opinion as well ki the human can still figure out a lot of things intuitively you can connect the dots your brain works like magic yeah. you know to be honest right you know to just feed it with some information iske baad mere paas ek in aisa question tha i think shark tank mein aapne bataya tha ki you did 10 years of work in your father's business first before you decided to venture into blix and then finally later on it became like an independent entity राइट तो जो दस साल आपका एक्सपीरियंस था पहला तो वॉज इट अ कॉन्शियस डिसीजन टू ज्वाइन द बिजनेस एंड उसके बाद वॉट वॉज लाइक द मोटिवेशन अपार्ट फ्रॉम द फैक्ट दैट यू फाउंड अ गैप इन द मार्केट टू काइंड ऑफ वेंचर इन टू यूर ओन बिजनेस बिकॉज डेफिनेटली नाइक यू नो यू स्टार्टिंग प्रिटी मच अ बिजनेस फ्रॉम जीरो राइट तो वो दस साल वॉज इट हेल्पफुल डज इट हेल्प पीपल टू सॉर्ट ऑफ बी इन अकोसिस्टम जहाँ पे कैसा चल रहा है पहले सीख लो थोड़ा कितना एडवांटेज मिला आपको उससे 
मेरे को जमीन आसमान का फर्क है यू नो बिटवीन इफ आई टू डू दिस विदाउट दी एक्सपीरियंस इन जफायर एंड इफ आई टू डू दिस विद दी एक्सपीरियंस इन जफायर तो एक्चुअली मेरा दस साल का एक्सपीरियंस ओवरऑल है बट uh, uh, मैंने मेरा एम किया था सिंगापुर से सो आफ्टर दैट आई हैड एड अपॉर्चुनिटी इन सम बैंक एंड सम फाइनेंशियल इंस्टीट्यूशन एंड माई फाइनेंस वॉज रिलेटेड गुड बट आई वॉज नेवर इंटरेस्टेड इन इट एट ऑल एंड टॉयज तो ऐसा है ना दैट आई वॉज आई ऑलवेज लाइक टू बिल्ड थिंग्स इन माई हैंड एंड टॉयज वॉज वेरी एक्साइटिंग मतलब इट्स समथिंग दैट वुड एक्साइट एनी बडी तो देर वॉज अ फाइनेंशियल एस्पेक्ट ऑफ इट दैट Yes, I can you know Singapore में रह के अच्छा life बना सकते हैं अच्छा job मिल जाएगा right. अच्छा salary मिल जाएगा तरह की होगी you know all of those things right. but then or, but then I'm as a person only very passionate I have to every moment I I can only do something that I'm interested in तो वो thought के साथ मेरे को लगा कि यार ये कभी चलेगा नहीं so that's when I thought that uh, that we come back to India mm. uh, and join my father's business क्योंकि मैंने so this was when This was in 2011. 2011, okay. Yeah. In the business, I learned that the best product not always wins. You know, uh, uh, the best supply chain not always wins. I mean, there are everything has to work right mm-hmm. for that thing to. I mean, Coca Cola. You see, that is such a big company. They are they are just sell, selling sugar water, right? Anybody can. I mean, you can't get an exact taste. You don't know the formula, but you can get really close to it. Mm-hmm. But they work so well because their marketing works perfect. Their communication is perfect. Their so many things that you have to do right to get your business off the ground mm. so the product is a very small part of it mm. um again like i mentioned earlier also more than the product is can i communicate this to my audience or not mm. so jab main toy banata tha mereko interest tha ki main aisa toy banau i would like to play with it you know main aisa toy banau i would like to play with it but wo कस्टमर के पास जाते जा, जाते जाते देर अ डिस्ट्रीब्यूटर इन द मिडल देर अ रिटेलर इन द मिडल वो कम्युनिकेशन इज ऑलवेज लिटिल डिफिकल्ट ऑनलाइन इफ यू थिंक हाउ डू यू गिव अ हैंड्स ऑन एक्सपीरियंस टू समथिंग लाइक दिस टू अ कस्टमर ऑन एमेजॉन और ऑन समथिंग एल्स तो वो सब सोच सोच के वी हैव टू थिंक अबाउट वॉट बिजनेस दैट इज वॉट आई हैव अ लर्निंग फॉर ऑल्सो हु इज आर ऑडियंस सो मैंने क्या रियलाइज किया इसके आई एम वेरी पैशनेट अबाउट टॉयज I want to make great learning tools, mm. but the best-selling toy in India is still today uh, probably a sap seed, uh-huh. you know, a snake and ladder. So there is a comfort zone that parents have, the masses have, where they go to buy a toy. It's more of a very uh, I don't want to think too much when I'm taking that decision. It's my right. child's prerogative. Right. So वैसा वो लोग decide करते. So if I come out with a really good concept also, it's difficult to get a customer who is not want. Who's not having the time to take a call? Right. In education, when I shifted, no, the ticket size were bigger. And this was one big thing I learned in the whole business of schools also. Hmm. So if you see now today, our product has four stakeholders. Okay. You know when we are selling to a school, first of all is the school management. Hmm. Right. उनको पैसा देना. So first when we used to say, आपके school में एक lab set up करो मेरा ये दस product है आप दस product ये ये करते ये ये करते ये कर then the school will ask why I need this iska zarurat hai kya isko main double kar sakta hu kya so all of these questions hmm. now the problem over there is also that the school ka management does not understand uh, it stem and robotics so, main ek cheez bolna chahunga yes because i look at things in a very like business centric perspective kafi time se matlab 10 saal pehle se bhi when i'm looking at schools like school jab main dekhta hu na mujhe dikhta hai bank bank मतलब इतना इट्स अ मिंटिंग मशीन स्टिल दे हैव लाइक सो मच सॉर्ट ऑफ लाइक थिंग्स वेर इन वेर इन दे हैव टू सॉर्ट ऑफ इन्वेस्ट राइट दे गो थ्रू लाइक सेवन डिफरेंट लेवल्स ऑफ चेक एंड टू मच स्क्रूटनाइजेशन की यार ये करना है कि नहीं करना है जबकि सामने से तो स्टूडेंट्स आर लाइक इन्फिनेटली पैसा आते ही रहेगा मतलब प्रिटी मच इट्स वेरी डिफिकल्ट फॉर अ स्कूल टू गो रॉन्ग कम्प्लीटली That is why schools have so much power also, hmm. right? I mean, today if you are in the education business, you want to work with the school. Because hmm. जब Indian parent का क्या mentality mentality रहता है, मैंने मेरे बच्चे को school में भेज दिया, अभी school का जिम्मेदारी है कि उसको पढ़ाने का, you know, right. give him the skills. Right. So that's why after school activity करने को बहुत difficult रहता है, क्योंकि वो parent का initiative लगता है. Hmm. Not all parents have the time or the effort to or the right. knowledge and experience to do that initiative. So you were talking about the schools thing. We were discussing the schools thing. राइट एंड यू यू आर टेलिंग अबाउट कि ये एक्सपीरियंस कैसा रहा अपना दस साल का एंड डज इट डिड इट हेल्प यू यस सो इट इट डेफिनेटली हेल्प्स अ लॉट मतलब जस्ट बेसिक बिजनेस एक्सपीरियंस आल्सो हेल्प्ड अ लॉट आई वाज टेलिंग अबाउट द स्टेक होल्डर राइट एंड यू सेड दैट स्कूल को देखता हो तो बैंक दिखता है तो पेरेंट्स और स्कूल के बीच में हमेशा एक ट्रस्ट डेफिसिट रहता है 
वेन एवर द स्कूल सेज नो आई एम गोइंग टू चार्ज यू सो मच फॉर दिस पेरेंट को लगता है क्यों नाउ स्कूल इज फाइंडिंग न्यू रीजन टू टेक मोर मनी फ्रॉम अस तो उनका वो मतलब वो जाके yeah. उतना पैसा तो पिज्जा के ऊपर खर्चा कर देंगे बट दे विल ऑलवेज लुक एट द एक्सपेंस फ्रॉम अ स्कूल वेरी कॉशियसली सो वी हैव टू नॉट ओनली मेक श्योर दैट द स्कूल प्रिंसिपल इज ओके उनका सबसे बड़ा कंसर्न रहता है कि यार पेरेंट्स को अगर अच्छा नहीं लगा ना वो मोर्चा लग जाएगा यार राइट मेरे स्कूल के दैट इज वाई स्कूल आर स्लो इन इम्प्लीमेंटिंग एनीथिंग न्यू बिकॉज दे डोंट वॉन्ट टू गेट दैट एंगर ऑफ द पेरेंट्स टू कम आउट ऑन देम तो बहुत बड़ा टेंशन रहता है स्कूल्स के लिए अच्छा इसमें मेरे को एक क्वेश्चन आ रहा है माइंड में यू सेड अबाउट कि सिंपल रखना चाहिए प्रोडक्ट समझना चाहिए राइट एंड वॉट आई ऑल्सो नोटिस्ड is india mein the complicated board games right which require good thinking skills and it will probably help the kid in the future wo utne nahi chalte jaise saap seedi jaisa game bahut chalta hai but on the flip side monopoly and anything that requires like you know cluedo naam ka ek game aata tha right wo itna culture mein kyun nahi what do you think is the problem with like the indian system ki logo ko utna wo jana nahi mehnat nahi karni hai jabki i i can vouch ki it will help like for example if i had played more of monopoly i would be good with finance even now right better than what i am right now right so what do you think is the problem like or why are we like this in india i think india ke andar time hi nahi milta hai bachcho ko i mean people don't have leisurely time so a board game like if you think of dungeons and dragons and those kind of board games those kind of board games wo ek game khelte khelte tumhare ko hafta nikal jayega you know mahina nikal sakta hai udhar hai na they have time people go to each other's houses go bed ke matlab dekho na koi bhi passion mera ek cousin tha either when he was staying in the staying in india when he shifted to the us today he he had a passion for flying to a pilot ban gaya uska bhai racing karta hai gaadi ka racing karta hai how do you find avenues to do how do you find the time to do so in india that uh, opportunity to explore and do hobby i things are very low as compared to what it is in the west i feel That is the main reason. There is a cultural difference. Like, thoda jis tarikhe se wo apna apna decisions lete hain time ka, right? The the way they budget everything out probably. Correct. Because also board games are not looked at in in India. You think of play only for children. You right. don't think of play for adults. Right. And those kind of board games which are complex and everything, wo pura adult communities rehta hai jo bed ke wo log game khelte. इंडिया में कितने अडल्ट एक्चुअली बैठ के गेम खेलेंगे वेरी फ्यू सो दैट कल्चर इज नॉट रियली सो स्ट्रॉन्ग शार्क टैंक की थोड़ी बात करते हैं लाइक यू नो हाउ वॉज योर एक्सपीरियंस राइट लाइक फॉर एग्जाम्पल फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल लाइक डिड यू अप्लाई बिकॉज आई हर्ड फ्रॉम अ डिफरेंट फाउंडर दैट दे वर सेलेक्टेड बाई डिफॉल्ट दे डि नॉट अप्लाई I don't think that is ever. I've never heard of a single founder who. Was, it, it was the first time I heard as well, but he was. I mean, that is his story, absolutely. I don't know that founder at all, but I don't think that that would be possible. Uh, okay. They get lots of applications. Their process, yeah. I think, is very set. I've spoken to lots of founders. Everybody's gone through the same exact process. Okay. So, पहले एक छोटा सा form रहता है. वो फॉर्म भेजो. उनको अच्छा लगता है. Then they will. Then they will say, send us more details for the second round. you send them more details then they will do um, if they like it they'll tell you shoot a video mm-hmm. and send us mm-hmm. ki tumhara pitch karte hue mere ko ek video maar ke bhejo wo unko acha lagega to audition hota hai audition unko acha laga to fir final selection hota hai so this whole process is i think from my experience standard throughout the board everybody has gone through the same exact process. right right and how real is it after the fact like once you get selected and you're queued up उस पॉइंट से लेकर एग्जीक्यूशन तक विच इज द डे ऑफ शूट हाउ रियल इज इट और वॉट चेंजेस इन बिटवीन सो वेन आई हैड डन माई पिच जो मैंने वीडियो शूट किया था और उनको भेजा था इज वेरी डिफरेंट फ्रॉम वॉट आई डिड इन द शार्क टैंक बिकॉज देर एक्चुअली राइट द एंटायर पिच फॉर यू राइट सो आप उनको दो तीन आइडिया डिस्कस करो वॉट एवर बट दे विल राइट द एंटायर पिच फॉर यू यू कैन मॉडिफाई इट यू कैन बी वेरी एडमेंट मेरे को चेंज करना है दे विल चेंज ऑल्सो बट उनकी क्रिएटिव टीम काफी हेल्प करती है दैट्स व्हाट इन्वॉल्व होती है अभी मेरे चक्कर में आई नो दैट फाउंडर समटाइम्स आर यू नो आई डोंट वांट टू डू दिस इन ऑल इन माय ओपिनियन एज लॉन्ग एज माय ब्रांड वाज नॉट बीइंग डाइल्यूटेड आई वाज थिंकिंग कि इन लोग को ज्यादा पता है क्या चलेगा मेरे को चाहिए कि मेरा एपिसोड सबसे ज्यादा वायरल हो राइट सो इन दैट परस्पेक्टिव आई वुड टेक देयर एडवाइस एंड काइंड ऑफ वी केम आउट टुगेदर टू मेक अ पिच दैट वर्क and that's how we had done so wo pure jo pitch ka time hai mera 1.5 ghante ka chala tha uske andar only the first 2 minutes is uh, prepared mm-hmm. the initial pitch mm-hmm. and the rules are that they won't interrupt you in that 2 and a half minutes mm-hmm. you can do whatever you want to do okay. uh, and after that the conversation starts 
एंड द कॉन्वर्जेशन इज कम्प्लीटली ऑर्गेनिक तो मैं बहुत प्रिपेयर किया था उसके लिए लेकिन कुछ काम भी नहीं आया बिकॉज इट्स ऑल इन दर हैंड्स इट कैन गो एनी वेयर इट्स प्रॉपरली लाइक इन्वेस्टमेंट डिस्कशन बट इन फ्रंट ऑफ कैमराज एंड पीपल इन ऑल दैट येस राइट right when it comes to the deal right you had i think 80 lakhs for 2% right abhi jaise ki jitne bhi episodes maine dekhe hain this time i believe in my observation season 3 mein jo asks aa rahe hain from the pitch perspective they are pretty high matlab crores mein bahut sare asks hain compared to season 1 if you see you would not see that many pitches asking a crore or more in shark tank right so did you feel later on or do you feel now that your initial ask was lower or it could have been higher or was it a fair ask as per your plan uh, so frankly the only reason i asked for 80 lakhs was there was no purpose of how how much money do i need mai kya karne wala hu wo kuch thought hi nahi tha 80 lakhs because uh, i understand that in shark tank no they can't offer you anything less than what you ask hmm. so agar aap 80 lakh mango to 1 crore leke ja sakte ho lekin aap 40 lakh lekin deal nahi kar sakte okay so that's a rule okay right uh so for that reason uh, i didn't want to give a very high number because i wanted a deal on the tank because mm. all said and done shayad log bhool bhi jayenge lekin deal mili thi ki nahi mili thi that's an answer that they will remember right mm. so one very important thing was that which is why i asked for 80 lakhs it was less than a crore mm. plus the sharks are not vcs right they are angel investors un matlab wo investing pattern bahut alag rehta hai compared to what a vc would do um so it was nothing about how much i needed or all of that it was it was like, like a fair number ki ye close hone layak hai close hone layak realistic hona chahiye and i can justify it in case questions are asked so based on that 80 lakhs i'd come out with kitna stake dena chahiye and everything okay got it got it. and eventually i think the deal closed around 84 4% 4% right and uh, ritesh and aman both came in right i noticed matlab main episode dekh raha tha abhi bhi maine ek do bar dekha to uh, what was unique was that ki kafi matlab अमन वॉज काफी प्रेशराइजिंग भाई भाई हम बहुत देर से बात कर रहे हैं लास्ट हाया ना करते वरना मैं और वो ऑब्वियसली कट करके ज्यादा कंप्रेस करके दिखाते हैं शो पे बट हाउ वॉज द इन्वायरमेंट लाइक ओवर देर जब सही में चल रहा है एंड यू आर ऑलमोस्ट एट अ पोजिशन फॉर अ सेकेंड और स्प्लिट सेकेंड की भाई अब तो डील ही नहीं मिल सकती एंड आई थिंक ऑन द बैक ऑफ योर माइंड बिकॉज यू हैड एट्टी लैक फॉर टू परसेंट योर मेन गोल वॉज की डील लेके निकल रहा है तो वॉट वॉज योर इमीजिएट इमोशन उस पॉइंट पे राइट हां तो वो लोग एक्चुअली में बहुत कम दिखा है सो इट वाज आई वाज रेडी टू गो फॉर 80 लाख फॉर 5% यू नो एवरीबॉडी कम्स विद अ नेगोशिएटिंग रूम राइट सो आई वाज रेडी टू गो आउट ऑफ द टैंक विद अ डील ऑफ 80 लाख फॉर 5% इवन दो आई दैट वैल्यू इज नॉट जस्टिफाइएबल बट ऑन शार्क टैंक इट इज फॉर द पीआर एंड एवरीथिंग दैट आई गेट एग्जैक्टली उतना मतलब लोग थोड़ा मैच अगर लगाएंगे तो उतना आप समझ लो पीआर में इन्वेस्ट करोगे तो 2-4 करोड़ से ज्यादा ही चले जाएंगे बहुत ज्यादा चले जाएंगे राइट हां और एंड वी वांटेड टू बी अ सक्सेसफुल शार्क टैंक कंपनी एटलीस्ट इन द पिच प्लस आपका वो एयर होने का चांस भी बढ़ जाता है कि गो आउट विद द डील बिल्कुल सो उन लोगों ने काफी छोटा किया था एक्चुअली द कन्वर्सेशन वाज गोइंग ऑन फॉर क्वाइट सम टाइम एंड मैं पीयूष को बहुत रिस्पेक्ट करता हूं यू नो दैट्स व्हाई व्हेन ही सेड दैट आई एम ऑन होल्ड आई वांटेड टू नो हिज ओपिनियन बिफोर आई टेक द डिसीजन अमन को बहुत गाली भी पड़ी बिकॉज ऑफ दैट आई मीन इफ यू सी दैट देयर इज अ देयर इज अ परसेप्शन दैट ही पुश्ड वेरी हार्ड एंड राइट राइट बट आई अप्रिशिएट बिकॉज Uh, he was also the first person to give a deal hmm. you know so he was the first person to give a deal pehle he was the most uh, not agreeing with the idea and everything matlab right. unko sabse pessimist wohi the right. in this story ka thing right but eventually he was the first person to give a deal right uh, he waited for whatever time it is i wanted to get piyush's okay on that kyunki hmm. piyush ne bhi mere ko 80 lakh 4% first he offered Hmm. 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 So like, what do I talk to my wife? You know, what, is it do I have the offer or not? How do I make a decision without it? Right. So, baki sharks ne bhi unko thoda bola. Right. So he said, assume it is there, but when you come back, I'll have to confirm. Right. You know. So right. that was with what with what I went outside the tank to have right. that conversation. Right. 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 Um, 
got it got yeah, it got it, it. so at the end you were satisfied with the deal that you walked out with right yes yes i mean i got a lot of people asking why you took such a conditional deal why you took such a conditional deal ha huh, that was a very shaky condition matlab but i guess like i've seen if you observe any of the other pitches wherever there is like more than one organization being discussed hmm. i uh, there is a lot of matlab wo kafi hold back kar lete apne deals ko ki yaar ye dena chahiye ki nahi ab is founder ko dekh hi nahi de so why why do you think that is हाँ मतलब वो उनको तो डर रहेगा ही ना यार इफ यू गिविंग मनी टू समबडी यू वांट टू अभी कोई बैंक वाला तुम्हारे को लोन दे रहा है ये कम ये प्रॉपर्टी का यू वो प्रॉपर्टी का पैसा लेके यू पुट इट समवेयर एल्स ही इज वेरी कंसर्न अबाउट दोज थिंग राइट सो दे हैव चेक्स एंड बैलेंस इज इन प्लेस सो इन्वेस्टर्स ऑल्सो एम गेसिंग आर हैविंग चेक्स एंड बैलेंस लाइक दैट आई डेंट हैव अ प्रॉब्लम विद दिस क्योंकि हाउ एल्स विल आई गेट एन एग्जिट फ्रॉम जेफ आर यू नो दैट आई लुक एट इट एज अ ग्रेट वे फॉर मी ऑल्सो टू गेट एन एग्जिट फ्रॉम from the fire if i have to and my brother for all you know he might get a better partner than me also so i look at it as a win win matlab mera wo episode air hone ke baad i asked the due diligence team and his uh, firm ki how will you determine the valuation at which you will buy my 20% of zafar so they said that is going to be a very natural thing they will have their own uh, uh, valuation expert mm-hmm. we will have our own valuation expert they will come out with two numbers we will discuss it and we will close it mm-hmm. so if that it, if it happens if it ever has to happen if it so ever I has to happen. see it as a opportunity also for me yeah mm-hmm. absolutely 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 mm-hmm. aman ka ek statement tha uh, program ke andar like you know bachcho ko bachcho bachche rehne dena chahiye and which is like aligned with the thing that we were just discussing so what is your opinion on that ki because in my opinion if you think about it like i am an extremely curious person now i was not like this as a kid pehle main itna sochta nahi tha observe nahi karta tha because i think ecosystem alag tha fir maine main jab hostel chala gaya to puri life hi badal gayi uske baad se i have been like super curious and i like this aspect of me aur mujhe lagta hai ki bachcho ko bhi early stage mein to zyada absorption capability hoti hai jitna tumne unki curiosity ko badhaya utna wo samajh lo compounding effect hai life mein and mere pov se अगर आप ऐसा कर पाओगे इंडिया के साथ इंडिया के यंग किड्स के साथ भी तो आई थिंक इंडिया विल आल्सो बी एट अ डिफरेंट पोजीशन 20 30 इयर्स लेटर व्हाट्स योर ओपिनियन ऑन दैट अमन ने लाइक यस सो बेस्ड ऑन अमन का क्वेश्चन ऑफ बच्चों को बच्चों रहने बच्चे रहने दो राइट अभी तुम अगर देखोगे ना बहुत छोटे बच्चे जो रहते हैं वो बर्तन को मारते हैं राइट दे विल प्ले विद अ कार्डबोर्ड बॉक्स यू ब्रिंग अ टॉय वो टॉय के साथ भी खेलेंगे को टॉय के डब्बे के साथ भी खेलेंगे तो वो जो मारता है ना दैट्स व्हेन दे लर्न अबाउट थिंग्स दैट वी टेक फॉर ग्रांटेड टुडे लाइक फॉर एग्जांपल ग्लास विल ब्रेक मैंने अगर ऊपर से नीचे गिराया तो वो टूटता है फॉर अस इट्स लाइक अरे यार ये ग्लास टूट गया फॉर हिम इज लाइक ओ माय गॉड आई हैव नेवर सीन समथिंग लाइक दिस आई गॉट एन एक्सपीरियंस तो फॉर मी आई फील के प्ले नो इज द मोस्ट मोस्ट ऑबवियस वे ऑफ लर्निंग अगर आप एंड दिस एग्जांपल वी गिव आल्सो इफ यू सी अ लायन कब you know they play fight with their siblings that's how they are learning to be a master predator mm-hmm. if you see a deer foal bachcha oh they are jumping around and they are you know running around that's how they learn how to evade the master predator mm-hmm. so children are to playing aaj hum log nahi decide karte wo log kabhi khel rahe kabhi nahi khel rahe wo jab bartan maar rahe na wo khel rahe tabhi because they are doing something that is satisfying their curiosity and their interest mm-hmm. right this also is something like that ab bachcho ko de do it's not it is something that they will they, they will take the time and effort to build it and then they'll go and show it to everybody abhi jigsaw puzzle rehta hai every time why to do you can just buy a board poster leke chipka do i mean why to take the effort of just making a because the the satisfaction of having built something mm-hmm. you do that again and again mm-hmm. you get a uh, um, you get a confidence that i can do this better next time i can do this better next time i can do this better next time mm-hmm. as a driver if you have to drive from bombay to goa you know take a bus or something that's your work kitne sare log bolte long drive pe jaate yaar maza aayega is the same thing but you are doing it as play mm-hmm. right so this is something that children we don't think we don't look at we might not look at it as play but children will always look at it as play mm-hmm. yeah. that's a good 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 way to put it i think चिल्ड्रेन के पी ओ बी से सोचना चाहिए yes. उनके माइंड के पी ओ बी से सोचना चाहिए तब शायद डिसीजन और ये थोड़े से अलग तरीके से भी पेरेंट्स ले सकते हैं या आई मीन आप सोचो ना यू रिमेंबर वेन आई वेन आई वॉज इन अ चाइल्ड आई थिंक मोस्ट चिल्ड्रेन वो पेन रहता है पेन के अंदर स्केल डाल के बी लाइक अ प्लेन राइट वो दैट्स ऑल्सो प्ले दैट्स आर इमेजिनेशन इट सो सो स्ट्रॉग एट दैट टाइम दैट वी रियली बिलीव दैट वी आर ओवर द वॉटर एंड फ्लाइंग अराउंड सो अबास लाइक वॉट इज योर ट्वेंटी ईयर विजन मतलब इफ यू थिंक अ लिटिल बिट अहेड 
विजन वाइज कि ये तो बिजनेस यू विल कंटिन्यू टू ग्रो राइट यू विल कंटिन्यू टू सॉर्ट ऑफ बिल्ड दिस बिगर एंड बिगर राइट वॉट इज योर ट्वेंटी ईयर विजन सो यू नो स्कूल कैन स्कूल एग्जिस्ट विदाउट बुक्स नो कैन स्कूल एग्जिस्ट विदाउट ऑप्टिकल लेंसेज दैट यू लर्न अबाउट लाइक नो कैन स्कूल एग्जिस्ट विदाउट स्क्रीन ऑन विच यू कैन यू नो सी और कंप्यूटर और समथिंग नो दीज आर एसेंशियल पार्ट ऑफ अ स्कूल और एसेंशियल पार्ट ऑफ अ चाइल्ड लर्निंग प्रोसेस so i believe blix is also going to be that essential i mean not just blix but any product like this is going to be that essential mm. today in the world if you see it might look like a lego but in the utility of a child in a school it is a 100 times better than lego mm. even though lego is one of the world's best toys mm. i love it unka quality is top notch absolutely but in terms of how it is going to be used by a child a blix will be far better mm. i feel that this toy is going to be there in every school it has to be there hmm mera nahi to kisi aur ka in a similar way i just know what is the best this type of a product to design it so that that child can have the maximum impact the parent i told you right parent hmm. maybe oh, parent ko bachcha ghar pe jaake bolna chahiye aaj maine ye sikha ye sikha ye sikha hmm the teacher should be very happy with it the school management should be happy with it and the child should be very happy with it hmm so if you look at all of that you create a product this the type of product that has to be in a school i believe ki mera 20 year ka vision is a very big open canvas kyunki india ke andar 16 lakh school hai hmm abroad i mean sab mila ke there are going to be you know many crore a few crores of schools Absolutely. i think ki this is a very big opportunity for us a uh, ek isse related business related question hai mere paas aapke liye how important is it for a business to be profitable and what was your journey towards making sure that it gets there i think it has almost gotten there as per the tank pitch that i heard right so profitability how big does that role uh, how big uska role kitna bada hota hai to uh, so company mein invest to karna padta hai in the hmm. beginning okay hmm. i feel that many companies might need it hmm. by either to make tools or uh, buy a server if you're an online company or whatever it is right. utna to kharcha rahega that you will have to invest but if you start uh, thinking that i can only grow by investing money and if i stop putting that money my sales will crash my uh, prof my entire business will crash hmm. that is a dangerous thing where your wo wo ye mera perspective hai hmm. it's my perspective that hmm. you invest in the things like you invest in the capital that you need to get this business out hmm. but your marketing and your all those other expenses your operational expenses your uh, first level expenses should not bring your company into loss that's a very dangerous precedent to all right so final part of the conversation rapid fire who was your target shark before you entered you knew ki panel kya pata tha shayad aapko right to kaun tha aapke mind mein yaar is ye to hona chahiye um to i'll tell you uh, mere ko to i didn't have a favorite shark because i feel all the sharks give their own type of value right yeah. and agar main aman ke sath i'm not going to talk, go and talk to aman about logistics and supply chain and all of those things i'm not going to take his help on manufacturing or fa- our fa- factory or you know those sort of things mm-hmm. but i will definitely ask him for help on my amazon and my marketing and building a dpc brand part of it hmm. but overall i did feel that if amit would have been there no i would have liked to have him at the amit yeah. yeah yeah because uh, uh, i don't know i just feel that uh, some resonance some it. resonance is there so that being aside i think that all the sharks have built great business and nobody can build a business without having their fundamental all the fundamental right absolutely absolutely next question if you get a chance to pitch again from your own pitch what would you do differently so oh, today i would talk about my vision a lot more so at some point no it was uh, anupam made a statement like uh, for a business of revenue 4 crores this much multiple se zyada is not justified right yeah true in a very typical single sense but if you look at a vision no it can be justified mm. now the challenge was and if you look at how big the market is and what potential it has i would have done a better job of that of explaining that part of it mm mm-hmm. great amazing final question last ek do saal ke andar like do se teen saal ke andar blix say in the experience of running blix growing blix and bringing it towards profitability what has been your primary learnings क्या सीखा है आपने मेन जो आप किसी को एक्शनेबल फीडबैक दे सको सो दैट दे कैन आल्सो टेक अवे दिस फ्रॉम द वीडियो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल तो द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग इज दैट यू डोंट व्हेन यू आर रनिंग बिजनेस देयर इज नोबडी टू टेल यू व्हाट इज राइट 
what is wrong do hmm. this do hmm. that don't do this don't do that so you have to make a decision ki main jo kar raha hu wo sahi kar raha hu ki nahi kar raha hu hmm. uh, abhi wo hai na that allows us to remain in our comfort zone very easily so lots of times i'll be like i don't want to do this conversation with somebody to main wo agar mere ko phone i don't want to make that call because it's an un- uncomfortable call i have to ask mm. for money i have to do something like that so i might make a justification of why i should not make that call mm. you know because i have the power to do that so m- most important is to know what you have to do however difficult it is whatever your feeling is in your worst moments when you feel like giving up you still have to know what you have to do and what is the right thing to do and you have to be able to do it so मतलब एक सिस्टम बनाओ प्रोसेस बनाओ एंड यू हैव टू जस्ट वॉक द पाथ बिजनेस इज लाइक अ ड्यूटी राइट एंड यू हैव टू बी एबल टू कीप व्हाट यू वांट टू डू वेरी सेपरेट फ्रॉम व्हाट यू हैव टू और जो करना है वो तो करना है तो टू बी एबल टू हैव दैट इन द बेस्ट टाइम्स एंड इन द वर्स्ट टाइम्स समथिंग आई थिंक यू हैव टू लर्न बिफोर यू डू अ बिजनेस इट्स इजी टू डू इट विद द बॉस टेलिंग यू व्हाट टू डू और नॉट टू राइट राइट बट व्हेन यू द बॉस योरसेल्फ यू हैव टू फिगर दैट आउट लुक इन द मिरर एंड जस्ट टेक द डिसीजन You have to take the decision, and the de- all your insecurities. Bolega nee, aisa karega na to. Arey chalega yaar. Don't do it. This reason, that reason. But you have to keep all that aside and do what is the tough. Take the tough path. I mean, this is incredible, no- incredible, yeah. incredible lesson, Abbas. Thank you so much for being with us, and thank you so I much know. for sharing all of this value with the community. Right? We'll catch you up again. Thank you so much for having me, Arish. Thank you. Thank Thanks. you. Thank you. Nice talking to you.